Hi guitar fans in YouTube land, welcome to my video for my unboxing and review of this new Harley Benton 12 string acoustic guitar. And if you want to know a secret, it's really rather good. So without further delay, let's start off with my unboxing of this guitar when it finally arrived. Um, I'll tell you the story of uh, my buying of this guitar from Thomans in Germany um, and then we'll get back and uh, I'll play some uh, play some stuff on the guitar and uh, and give you my my thoughts and, and feedback on um, what I'm really surprised about um, was such a great guitar for for such a, a crazy price really anyway here's the unboxing Hi YouTube fans, um, this is probably the longest awaited unboxing video ever. It's the first time I've done an unboxing video. Uh, this is for my um, Harley Benton 12 string acoustic. Um, I've been waiting for this guitar now for over six months for one reason or another. Um, I'll tell you the story behind it very quickly. I originally ordered this in December last year. This is now May, um, back end of May 2022. Um, Originally when it was ordered, it was on a seven week lead time, so I ordered the Sunburst version. If I wanted the natural, I could have had it straight away, but I wanted to wait for the Sunburst. Um, I was told it would be in at the end of January. I got an email at the end of January saying that it wouldn't be uh, available now until April, obviously because of the supply chain issues, getting stuff in from China. I was like, fine, it's coming in April. Um, 20th of April, they said they'd shipped it. Um, unfortunately, just after that, I went on holiday to Florida for two weeks. So I tried to get it rearranged in terms of the delivery. And then the delivery company, DHL, promptly lost the parcel. Um, so I got back from Florida two weeks later, contacted Toman, and Toman then uh, arranged to ship me another one, um, which finally arrived today. So as I say, I've been waiting about six months for this guitar. Um, I'm hoping it's going to be worth the wait, so let's see if we can uh, get this open. That was a lot easier than I expected it to be. Let's see what's inside. Now this guitar, um, the reason I bought this guitar is I don't have a 12 string in my collection. Um, Harley Benton guitars have had some quite decent reviews considering they're a budget guitar. Um, this guitar actually cost me £228, um, which really is a steal for a, for a 12 string. Uh, this is also, there's a bit of blur that comes with it, um, this is also, um, you can plug this in, it's got a um, a piezo pickup in it. Um, let's see if we can get this open. Let me hope if I've got a knife, bear with me a second. A pair of scissors. So, this is the Harley Benton Custom Line. CLJ 412E3 SB, the Sunburst, obviously. Let's see what this looks like. It's pretty impressive. Comes with a spare battery or a battery for the uh, for the pickup. See what this baby looks like. Pretty cool actually. I very much doubt that it'll be in tune. Fantastic looking guitar. 
Um, I'm going to tidy this up and get it in tune, and then uh, I'll show it, show you what it sounds like when it's uh, when it's played. So that was me unboxing this guitar. Um, I've had the guitar for uh, a week or so now, and had a chance to to play it a little bit and uh, get some get some feedback. And I've got to say. Um, this is probably the best acoustic guitar I've ever bought. Um, I've not been a great fan of acoustics over the years. Uh, I'm mainly an electric player, because um, I've always found acoustics quite uncomfortable to play. Um, that's certainly been true of the two most recent acoustics that I've bought, which is, uh, I believe uh, my first serious acoustic was a Faith Venus. Um, that I, I bought a few years back and um, didn't, didn't particularly um, get on with um, very well. Um, so I thought I'd treat myself to a, a tailor uh, and see if, see if that was any better for me. Um, again, nice guitar, um, but in terms of playability, I still found it quite uncomfortable to play, being used to playing electrics all my life. So I changed the strings on both of my acoustics and, and, and put electric strings on them to make it easier to play and more comfortable. Um, but I've never had a 12 string acoustic and I saw this advertised at a crazy price of £228, which you, you can't really get anything for that these days. So this is an electroacoustic, so you can plug it in. Um, as you can see, uh, the battery compartment is there. Um, you, you're supplied with a battery from Tomans as part of the deal, so you don't even have to buy a battery for it. Um, played this through uh, an amplifier and it sounds very good. Um, but just playing it on its own. <laughs> great 12 string sound um, it's actually the most comfortable acoustic guitar I've ever played um, I don't see any reason to change the strings on this um, it's as I say the setup on this guitar is crazy it's a 228 pounds guitar it just feels so comfortable it was almost perfectly in tune when it came out of the box I had to do some um, some minor tuning on it um, it's got a built-in tuner um, there you can see uh, there's a Fishman pickup in this. Um, Fishman make the same pickups. I've got a Piezo uh, Les Paul slash with a Piezo Fishman pickup in it. So, you know, Fishman are a well known, um, well respected uh, brand name and manufacturer of, of, uh, of these kind of pickups. Um, I say it's got a built in tuner. Um, it, really, this guitar, I, don't, I can't really praise it high enough, highly enough. It's it's just very very good at what it does. Very easy to play, and for the money, you know, it doesn't. It feels like a great solid piece of um, piece of equipment. I don't know what the woods are. Can't go into the details of of all of that. I will post up a um, a spec for it. But to me, the most important thing with this was how easy it is to play, how great it sounds. <laughs> acoustic. I won't play any more of that, I might get a copyright strike. Um, it just has that great, a great jangle that you expect from, an, from, from a 12 string. Um, I really bought this um, so that I could play, you know, things like Wanted Dead or Alive, the intro to that. Um, and, and, and other things that just sound great on the 12 string. It's, 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 a, it's a great guitar. Um, I had to wait a long time to get this finish. If I wanted this in a natural finish, I could have got one of these straight away, but I decided to hold on for the sunburst because I really liked it. 
Um, it took it six months to arrive um, with the current supply chain issues that there are in the world. Um, but actually, that six months was um, was worth the wait to get this finished because it really is beautiful. Um, it's a very thin um, scratch plate on it, as you can see, but the actual the actual wood is very solid. The sound is great. Um, even the inlays, the inlays in the neck, really beautifully done. Um, you can't really see any finished blemishes on this. Um, it really is a, a top-notch piece of kit. And as I say, for the money, I can't believe, uh, you know, I would, I'm actually probably gonna invest in another Harley Benton acoustic because if they're six string acoustics, are as good as this 12 string, then I can't see any reason to, to wanna buy anything else or any other brand. Um, you know, I'm sure there'll be a lot of acoustic aficionados out there that will be saying, oh, but you know, this word and that word and the pickup doesn't sound that great or as good as A, B and C brand. But for my requirements, which are just really as, as, a, as an amateur kind of hobby player, as someone who, who does the occasional gig, acoustic gigs and things, um, I really don't need anything else. I don't need anything super exotic in terms of wood uh, or, or sound. Um, this kind of ticks all the boxes for me. You know, if you're sitting around a campfire, you pull out a 12 string and you play some songs, it's gonna sound great um, and, and people are gonna love it. Uh, again, can't recommend this highly enough. If you're in the market for a 12 string, you know, I think for Gibson and Fenders, they're, they're gonna be starting 500 pounds upwards for just a basic model. Um, and I don't see any reason why you, wouldn't, why you wouldn't invest in one of these. For the money, try it. If you don't like it, you can sell it. But for me, this particular guitar just plays great, sounds great, um, and by golly, it is great. Anyway, don't like and subscribe to this channel, please because I never know what I'm going to be posting stuff about. So the next video that I post may not be of any interest to you. So there's no real reason for you to subscribe. I'm not going to be doing guitar videos every five minutes the same way I've not, not done any Tesla videos or guitar tuition videos for a while. Um, I just post videos when, uh, when I get the urge. So I hope you enjoyed this. It's only been a very brief look at this, this um, Harley Benton 12-string uh, acoustic. I just really wanted to put out there my my initial thoughts and feelings just to give you some feedback if you're if you're concerned about buying one of these guitars and you think oh you know it's not going to be any good for that money i can guarantee you if this example is anything to go by you will not be disappointed spending spending 200 200 quid on this um as i say i may very well buy myself a six string harley benton because if that's as good then I'll sell the Taylor, I'll sell the, the Neptune, uh, sorry, the Faith, um, and I'll just stick with these because they're fantastic guitars. Anyway, thanks for watching and uh, hope to see you again soon.